upgrade your smartphone with Appalachian Wireless, get $300 off selected models. Capture memories, stream, and stay connected with the latest technology. Visit one of our stores or AppalachianWireless.com right now. On Tuesday, July 18th, the Pike County Fiscal Court held a meeting to discuss the rate increase proposed by Kentucky Power. Residents of Pike County could soon experience an 18% increase in their electric bill if the Public Service Commission accepts the offer. This could cause many people in the county to either cut costs elsewhere or leave altogether. We basically are trying to send the message that, you know, we're at the point, we're at a tipping point where people simply can't pay more. Uh, and it's, it's getting to be where a lot of people are going to have to leave the region uh, simply because the cost of living here is getting out of control. You also have to take into account the number of people that we have here who are senior citizens on Social Security, uh, disabled coal miners, retirees, and those folks, you know, their income is not going to go up 18.3% next year. The fiscal court does not support the decision to increase power rates. Jones is hopeful that the Public Service Commission hear the outcry from the Pike County residents. The fiscal court is of the opinion that an 18.3% rate increase in these economic uh, conditions that we're in um, would be very, very hard on a lot of people, senior citizens, people on fixed income. And you know, businesses are gonna pass those costs on to customers. Uh, it's going to be a burden on local governments to have to pay uh, additional costs as well. And ultimately the taxpayers and the ratepayers end up picking the tab up for that. We hope that this sends a message that while we recognize the situation facing the power company uh, and we appreciate what the power company's uh, men and women do that, that provide the service to us, that people here just can't pay that kind of rate increase. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.